Last minute, forest fire in Antalya. State hospital and settlements were evacuated. Breaking news. The forest fire that broke out in the evening hours in Antalya's touristic district of Kemmer grew rapidly while many teams participated in the extinguishing efforts. Kemmer State Hospital and the surrounding settlements were evacuated as a precaution. Antalya Governor Ursin Yazik stated that the fire spread 3.5 kilometers to the west and said, We call 10 households to be evacuated as a precautionary measure. 13 out of 15 patients in Kemmer State. Hospital went home. Two of our patients were transferred to other hospitals. A fire broke out at around 21.0 in the forest on the side of Kemmer Antalya Highway in Digermander District of Kemmer District of Antalya. Due to the strong wind, the flames spread out in an instant. Teams were directed to the region to extinguish the fire near the settlements and the highway. The fire is being intervened with 15 water tanks, 8 water tankers, 6 first response vehicles, as well as many teams. Reinforcement firefighters were also directed to the region from Antalya and Kamluka. Crews quickly reached the scene and started to respond to the fire. The surrounding settlements threatened by the flames were also evacuated as a precaution. Citizens also supported the extinguishing efforts. Fire spreads 3.5 km. Response continues Antalya Governor Ursin Yazik stated that as of 21.08, the fire started in Kemmer District Ganek neighborhood Degermender Cemetery location, underlining that the fire has been dealt with by 20 to sprinklers, 3 water supply vehicles, 5 response vehicles and 15 fire engines, Governor Yazik said. 13 construction machines are currently responding. 22 construction machines are on the way. 200 personnel are responding to the fire. The fire advanced about 3.5 kilometers west. We have winds blowing at 20 kilometers per hour. He's causing the fire to advance west. No damage was done to any residents, workplace, or living thing. Since the area where the fire took place is dense forest, we cannot get into the fire. Dozers are working in our location. Teams are working for the fire to progress to Kazdir District. We will try to change the way of the fire with the work we will do, he said. Patients in 10 hospitals and state hospitals have been discharged, stating that waterers, fire brigades, and tankers from the surrounding 10 provinces set off. Yazik said, 20 construction machines from the surrounding provinces are also on the way. Our problem is that we cannot enter the forest. We find it difficult to intervene closely in a few hours. The number of construction equipment and waterers will triple as of 5.30 in the morning. Our six helicopters and four planes will take off. There will also be support from the surrounding provinces. But our aircraft will begin to intervene from the air on the first morning. Everywhere was on alert at the moment. We call 10 households in our region to evacuate as a precaution. In Kemmer State Hospital, 13 of 15 patients went home. Two of our patients were transferred to other hospitals. Six people were affected by the smoke. Our Kemmer State Hospital continues to serve. Deputy Minister in Fire Zone. Deputy Minister of Interior Minor Kara Laklu. Deputy Minister of Agriculture and Forestry Vaisal Tiryaki. General Director of Forestry Becker Karka came to the region and received information from Antalya Governor Ursin Antalya Regional Director of Forestry Vedit Dikichi. At the Fire Coordination Center, Deputy Ministers made a statement after their examination. Deputy Minister of Interior Minor Carol Laklu wished Antalya and Kemmer a quick recovery and stated that there was a period of high risk in terms of fire and said, we are in a period when the humidity is low and the air temperature is high. There were fires in different provinces during the day. We took all of these under control together with our General Directorate of Forestry and other institutions of our state that helped. Currently, our fire in Kemmer continues. We hope that we will get this fire under control. With an intense intervention from the air as of sunrise in the morning, he said. Kemmer State Hospital is discharged. 
While the work continues to extinguish the fire, it was decided to completely evacuate Kammer State Hospital as well as the settlements. Where the flames approach, crews took action to evacuate. The teams took precautions around a fuel station located close to the fireplace. A call was made over the radio that a large number of manpower was needed. Crews continued to work intensively to extinguish the fire. No danger in tourism facilities. Hospital and 10 housings are evacuated as a precautionary measure, explaining that there is no fire threatening tourism facilities in Kemmer. The tourism region at the moment, Deputy Minister Kara Lockla said, Our guests continue to spend their holidays in peace in their facilities. There is Kemmer State Hospital, which is close to the fire area, as a precaution. Our dear governor evacuated the patients who were treated there. We had 14 patients in the hospital. 12 of them were discharged to their homes. Two of our patients were transferred to different hospitals. Again, a risky residence was transferred to the fire area. Again, a risky residence is still very risky. It was an area. It was evacuated by our governor's office. And AFAD, he said, air support will be provided with 20 to helicopters and 10 airplanes when the sun rises. Kara Lachlan said that when the sun starts to shine in the morning, an intense intervention will be carried out from the air and continued as follows. Because the terrain is very steep, the intervention from the land is very difficult. Right now friends are trying to move forward with dozers, but I know this land very well. I also walked when I was the governor of Antalya. The land is a difficult region. It is not easy to enter the land at the moment. Friends are having difficulties in intervening, but I hope from the air, with the sunrise. We will control the fire with an intense air operation with 20 to helicopters and 10 planes. 60 hectares burned as of 3 o'clock Vesel Tiriaki. Deputy Minister of Agriculture and Forestry stated that the last week has been an intense struggle against forest fires in our country. As in other countries of the world, unfortunately, our forestry organization, other public institutions and our municipalities, unfortunately, are struggling with these fires today. Around 21.00, a fire broke out in Antalya, the first in Tackle and the second in Degermender. Kemmer Gainek, the first was extinguished immediately. Both fires were responded to within 10 minutes. There are serious difficulties in the intervention. The fire is being intervened by our experienced workforce, which is involved in construction equipment. More than 50 sprinklers and more than 300 fire extinguishers. The wind strength is currently around 10 kilometers per hour. Hopefully, with the morning light, our air power will respond to the fire here with 20 to helicopters and 10 planes. The fire will be brought under control as soon as possible. As of this hour, approximately 60 hectares of area have been affected by this fire. There is no danger to the settlements at this time. More detailed information will be provided in the coming hours. President Tepaliklu, transportation by land is experienced. Kemmer Mayor Nikadi Tepalaklu said that the fire, which started in Degermander District, progressed in the forest area. Mayor Tepalaklu stated that due to the lack of aircraft capable of operating at night, they could not intervene from the air and said, all the vehicles of the Regional Directorate of Forestry and the municipality are here. Tomas are also coming. But there is a problem in reaching the region by land. Vehicles cannot enter the forest area because there is no road. Response to fire in Kemmer with 75 vehicles. In the statement made by the Regional Directorate of Forestry, it was noted that the forest fire in Kemmer was intervened with 37 sprinklers, 12 water supply vehicles, 11 first response vehicles, 4 dozers, and 11 excavators. On the other hand, the forest fire that broke out in the Tackle neighborhood of the Monavgat district in the evening was extinguished. 
It was stated that the fire was intervened with for water sprinklers, to water tankers, and to first. Response Vehicles Fire Watch in the Fire in Gannick Tourism Center Residents of the houses in Dudivler, where the flames approached 700 meters in Yanamahali, experienced fearful moments in the first minutes of the fire, the residents of the neighborhood, who saw the flames approaching, followed the extinguishing work of the teens with concern, the residents of the neighborhood, whose houses were saved from being damaged in the fire, breathed a sigh of relief as the flames changed direction, with the wind on the hill near the houses they lived in. Residents of 10 houses in the region were warned to be cautious. Some of the residents of the neighborhood started to stand guard in front of their houses, the people of the region, who watched the flames from afar and helped those who participate in the extinguishing efforts. Go to the roofs and follow the fire. Others watch the work in the market or in the area where they can stand in a crowded place, explaining that they came to the house. When they first heard of the fire, Elul Ali said the flames seemed very close. There was a smell of smoke in our neighborhood. The hill was covered with flames. Fire trucks came. Extinguishing work started. Everyone was very afraid. There are gas stations on both sides of our house. It would be dangerous if the fire came to the neighborhood. Everyone supports each other. Everyone is trying to calm each other down. We want the fire to be extinguished as soon as possible. Sitting in front of their house with his wife. And watching the firefighting efforts, Ramazan Karbi said, We got scared when we saw the fire. I went outside. We panicked when we saw the flames on the hill on the opposite side of us. We went to the roof. We relaxed when the extinguishing efforts started. Now we wait. Firefighters warned us. Get out in case of any negativity. They said, We wait. We cannot sleep. On the other hand, the air temperature in Kemmer was measured at 32.5 degrees at night. We are here to help you as Sir Hat Bullet, one of the young people waiting with the fire extinguisher, said, I say check the fire extinguishers. I came to my cousin on holiday from Izmir. The fire started around 21 o'clock. We came here to help. We're waiting here with the fire extinguishers. We are waiting for the fire not to come here in case the cones are thrown, he said, we came with fire cylinders, enter lawyer Fiti Yugal, who came to Kemmer from Antalya after the news of the fire, said, we came here with fire extinguishers because it was our duty. We are here for him. This place has redwood forests. When the cones exploded, we took precautions to prevent the citizens from coming to the places where they live. We are here until morning, he said.